don't know. Why the long face? Way to the world, Marco. Way to the world. Oh, well, here, maybe this will lighten your load a bit, Craig. Is the affidavit I drew you signed? Yes, I did. So you can tell Jessica that I will be a character witness for you. God forgive me. I'll take any help I can get. What's wrong with you? You're unusually morose. Morose? No. Disappointed. You're the only person who's come through for me so far, to be honest. Well, you're surprised? Who else did you expect to be on your side? Rosanna. For one, she's my best shot at getting any real place in my son's life, but thanks to her insane obsession of reuniting with someone who doesn't want her, I am out in the cold. What kind of support could you possibly expect from Rosanna? I wanted her to marry me. <laughs> well, you're kidding, aren't you? Is there a smile on my face, a laugh in my throat? A lump in your head? I need to prove stability to the court so I can have a place in my child's life. Oh, my goodness, that kind of logic should have swept Rosanna right off her feet. I made it very clear to her why I needed the help, and after all the help I gave her in Bangkok. Oh. It's not as if we're strangers, Jimmy. We've been married twice already. <laughs> A point I'm sure that Jennifer's lawyers are going to relish presenting to the judge. Why is it so hard to believe that I can be a good father, Marco? I need this. I can get this right. That's all I'm asking for. You. Well, Craig, you picked a pretty tough fight. But you know I can win it, don't you? I think that m maybe if you presented to Jennifer this vulnerable side of yourself like you're presenting to me, then I think you got a chance. I could open my chest and show her my beating heart and she wouldn't believe it. Or don't. I... <sighs> Just throw in the towel, Craig, huh? No. Not ready to do that yet, but there's a lot of technicalities. I'm afraid they might call the fight. Well, there's always another round if you're still on your feet. Am I? It's going to take more than a custody battle to knock you down, Craig. You're right. You know, I've been through worse, and look at me. I am whining. Uh-huh. How am I going to whine to anyway? You're the last person I should expect any sympathy from. I am about the last person in this town who has an ounce of sympathy for you. Oh, yeah. You were so compassionate, you ran me right out of town with a have a nice life and don't look back. All right, I said I was sorry about oh, that. Oh, am I sorry? Did I give the illusion that I'd forgiven you? You know what? You're either one of two things. You're either sad or you're angry. I prefer oh, no, you no, sad, no. This, because this, angry always gets you in trouble, Craig. This is not anger. This is focus, Margo. I will be a part of my child's life, and I will be as loving and caring a father as ever was. And if I have to break a few eggs to do that, so be it. 